altars where you need us. Yes. Take me there. Take me there. All you need is just an offering. Yes. I am here. I'll be right here. Because I'll be your living yes. sacrifice for you. The refiner, purifier. Yes. I want to be consumed. I want to be tried by fire. Purify. You take whatever you desire. Lord, is my I want to be tried. I want to be tried by fire. Purify. You take whatever you desire. Lord, here's my This song is literally inviting God in to do whatever he needs to do to make you to make you or to cause you to become who he designed for you to be. And it takes a refiner's fire. Hallelujah. 
It takes the refiner's fire. The Bible says our ministry should be tried by fire, whatever sort it is. In other words, whatever he's called us to do, we got to go through the fire. The fire purifies. It makes us not who we say we are, but who he wants us to be. And the thing about the fire, we've got these flames around the wall. The things about the fire, you have to invite God into. He, he don't force his way. You can't have revival without fire. You can have a religious experience. <clears throat> you can have a, a church service, but you won't have an encounter with God without the fire, without the fire of God. Amen. If you will, just lift up your hands if you can. Father, in Jesus' name, we thank you for who you are in our lives and in this place, God. We thank you, God, for our virtual family who have tuned in, who are faithful, Lord God, in connecting with this particular service. Now, Father, we yield ourselves unto you. Every man, every woman, every child, every place, God, that we are, physically and virtually, we invite you in even the more. God, consume the atmosphere. Burn everything that is not like you. God, we repent of every sin, transgression, broken vow, anything that would hinder us from being who you've designed and called us to be. As we set ourselves to receive your word, we ask you, Lord God, to speak to us one by one, name by name. God, we have a need in this place. And God, you know us better than we know ourselves. So we yield ourselves to you and say, revive us again. We need your revival in us, God, so that the land can be revived, so that our communities can be revived, our families can be revived. God, we thank you now. Have your way in this place. Speak with clarity. Speak with simplicity. But most of all, God, let us have understanding. We give you praise, honor, and glory. We thank you for salvation. We thank you for deliverance. Now we command in the atmosphere, be healed, be delivered, be set free. Be healed. Be delivered, and be set, set free. Be healed, haya. Be delivered, and be set free. We agree together, and it is so now. In Jesus' name, if you all agree, say amen and amen.